Hello, it's Coach Carmen, founder of Sharing the Bliss, and I am the Kingdom Health, Purpose, and Wealth Coach. I'm here today because it is day number seven of our 30 Days of Health to Wealth video series, or Health and Wealth video series. So I am really excited. I'm basking in the bliss of completing our Tele Summit yesterday. And we were supposed to have a, a closing ceremony today, but I woke up this morning Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit actually inspired me to do something different. So I got with my team and we decided to wait until next Monday and have a streaming event, a live streaming event. So that's what we're going to do. And I wanted to talk to you today about the importance of stretching beyond your comfort zone and doing videos. So and the reason why this came up for me is because we had a contest, a video contest that would allow the winner to receive a scholarship to our three month group package of purpose coaching program. It's a fifteen hundred dollar scholarship. And would you believe we had one person create a video? And this was after repeatedly inspiring people, reminding them about the videos. Some were saying they would do it and they never did. And even the person that did do the video, I actually had to really encourage her to do so. And I was really pretty shocked that so many people were so insecure about doing a video. So I wanted to talk to you about that today. And first tell you my story of how I started doing videos and believe me I was one of the least likely candidates to start doing videos especially the time in which I started which was back in 2000 and I think 2009 2010 perhaps I got my YouTube video um, uh, channel put up but I was in the throes of a very serious and debilitating blood disease that had disfigured my um, my skin to the point where I was covered with very very serious um, eczema and I mean my skin was like maybe a quarter inch thick all over I had sores and open wounds and I uh, my skin was split open I mean I really looked like a horror movie my skin was very uh, the, the, the color was just not even normal it was really a terrible time in my life and it had gone on for a couple of years I decided to heal myself holistically so it took quite a while but um, but I have no side effects and as you can see God truly did um, a miracle on me. I am I am a living miracle. So um, without any medication, to God be the glory. So I was watching YouTube at this time. I started in 2007. That's when I first got sick and I was homebound. Um, around the end of 2007. And I watched several people make blunders and really look kind of foolish but to me i thought it was adorable just watching them come into their own experiencing practicing trying different things and the, the ultimate goal of most of them was to be able to make a living um online and i saw them try different uh selling different things marketing different things and going for coaching, and lo and behold, I watched a transformation um, occur, one after the next. I mean, it was amazing. I got to see people change their attitude, the, the, the way they spoke, the way they looked, and the next thing you know, they were bringing in money. I saw them go from having much of nothing to actually becoming very, very well off. Some of them, I've seen many of them go all the way up to seven figures because they were consistent with their videos. And what I want to say about this is that 
I'm a little warm here. It's kind of warm today, and I don't have my air conditioner on. I didn't want the noise. So, uh, what I felt was that a lot of people have so many insecurities that they really need to just get over. And I'm saying that, as I said, because I had to get over insecurities. I knew that God had given me something to say, and I had an audience out there that needed to hear it. And that's what I want to say to you. I'm going to be stern with you today and, and let you, you know, know that or remind you of something you already know. You were called for a purpose and for, and for such a time as this where we have access to these amazing platforms to get ourselves out there without even leaving the house. You don't even have to leave the house. How awesome is that? So you practice, so you find your best um, sweet spot, you know, in and, and, and how you uh, position yourself so that you look a little better. So you put on a little makeup, uh, ladies. So you, you, you do a few things and you do whatever you have to do until you get comfortable enough to shoot a video that you want to upload. It may take 10 times at first. It's worth it because once you put that video out, the whole universe is going to turn in your direction and say, oh, wow, she's ready. He's ready. He's serious. You have no idea who God has out there for you to touch, but you'll never know until you go out there and reach your hand out so that they can touch you and you can touch them. So I want to encourage you today that even if you think you have a funny voice, which I did, there are people out there that will love your voice. Even if you think that you have something weird that you do when you talk, there's somebody out there, hundreds, maybe even thousands, that would think that that is so adorable. If you stump, stumble over your words, which I often do, people, they want to hear what you have to say. And all of that other stuff is trivial. The bottom line here is that we have to get over ourselves. The Holy Spirit had to tell me this. I mean, he was pretty stern with me. Um... I never forget it. It was like, it's not all about you. And I was like, uh oh. I, you know, it, I'm, it made me feel like, wow, I must have been pretty um, full of myself. That I was so concerned about how I looked that I, and what I sound like, and, and everything else, and maybe not having the right words to say or not be able to say them correctly, that I was losing the most important point, And that is that I had been given some information. I've been given a, a gift, just like you have been. And it would be totally selfish for me to hold it to myself, hold it within myself, because I didn't think that people would want to receive it from me. They want the gift. So if it comes from me, that's okay. But guess what? Most of the people who will watch you will be the people that you were called to. And they will sit and listen to you. And God will close their eyes not to see the things that you think are such a problem. And they will only see what they need to see so that they can hear what they need to hear. So I hope that blesses you, beloved. Believe me, I can totally relate. Even now, I look at you know my videos and I'm like, oh my God, oh. But you know what? I got over it and I get over it continually because I know in my heart that I'm touching somebody, that someone's being blessed. And if I can do that, it's worth being self-conscious for a moment but you know what it's time for us to be Christ conscious because the God in us is, is bigger and brighter than any of our insecurities and he will shine so bright within you beloved that he will burn away every unwanted thing every issue that you think you have 
will just go back to the nothingness in which you came and the glory of God will shine bright within you. So that's what it's all about. So that's it for of it. I will see you tomorrow. God bless you. This was video number seven. Woo -hoo. It's exciting. It's exciting. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.